Firefighters are trying to make sure a fire that broke out in the Keolu Hills area late this afternoon doesn't flare up again. KITV4's Catherine Cruz has been monitoring the situation. Catherine? Well, Laura, fortunately, the blaze did not seriously threaten homes, although residents were warned to be prepared to evacuate because of the thick smoke and ash that drifted into the neighborhood. Weary firefighters lined the street in this Keolu Hills neighborhood tonight after spending three and a half hours trying to contain a fire on the ridge. John Carpenter and his wife were in town working when they got the word, come home quick. Got a call from one of my neighbors that said uh, there's a fire behind the hillside and they're evacuating the homes or possibly for smoke inhalation and so forth. So we just rushed home. Firefighters responded to the 3.30 call. The fire had fanned out and flames could be seen on several fronts as the blaze made its way up the ridge. When they had to go up that hill in the middle of the afternoon with all their equipment dragging those hoses up the hillside, it was a job. While fire crews beat back the flames, the department's helicopter sprung into action, making repeated water drops. From afar, it seemed the task was daunting, but bucket after bucket on the fire's edge finally got the slow-moving fire under control. The fire did crest the ridge at one point, but the weather conditions helped firefighters keep the blaze from heading down the ridge toward Lanikai. The wind is blowing from the opposite direction, so it actually slows it down. And there's quite a bit of uh, terrain. There's several ridge lines between uh, this area and the closest home in the Lanikai area. John Carpenter was glad his pets and home were safe and sound. He and other families were grateful for the department's efforts. This is probably the first time in about, uh, I would say, over 20 years that we've had a fire on this hillside. We've always worried about it, but this is the first time. And tonight, the fire department hopes for some overnight rain. And while it did rain last night, prospects for more Malka showers are not looking good. Laura? All right, thanks a lot, Catherine. Remember, if you have any shots from uh, today's brush fire or any photos or videos of news you'd like to report, you can share them by posting on the ULocal page of KITV.com. We'll